Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be storing all of my Wanu items that I have received over the past couple of weeks. So Wanu is my ultimate bias and he is actually going to get his own binder. As you can see, I have so many photo cards and so many large inclusions. And in fact, there are over 50 items in this haul today. So yeah, let's get on into the video. Okay, now getting into the photo card storing part of this video. So I am also going to be setting up this binder. This binder is going to be just Wanu for now, but hopefully after a couple of weeks or a couple of months, this binder will end up being home to maybe three members of 17 or six members or even OT 13, depending on how I go. So as you guys saw before, these are all the photo cards that I'm gonna store there in a stack there's a couple of album and non-album photo cards. And then I have my larger inclusions, which also includes some album and some non-album stuff. And then I also prepared these photo card fillers and they are for all the photo cards that I don't have yet because I think it will help me to organize everything. So I have my iPad here and you can see these are all of Wanu's album photo cards and we are just going to go in chronological order and store all of the items. So starting off with Boys B, so this was um, the first album where they had photo cards. Um, so they are really hard to find, so I don't have them yet, but I am going to just store these two um, photo card fillers. Okay, next moving on to Love and Letter, the repackage. There are also two Polaroid style photo cards, which I don't have yet. So I've prepared two fillers as well, and they are just gonna go after the first album. I'm not particularly leaving any spaces for now because I don't think I'll be able to get these photo cards anytime soon. So they can just go in these spaces. Okay, and then moving on to Going 17. So for Going 17, there are three individual Wanu cards and then two unit cards. Um, so that's these five fillers. Again, I don't have any of them on hand at the moment. Um, I did trade with someone for this Wanu Mingyu unit, so hopefully that will arrive soon. But for now, I'm just gonna put them in version order and then with units at the end. Okay, so that is the first page done. Unfortunately, no photo cards for this first page, but that's okay. Now, moving on to the second page. So for the second page, we're gonna start off with AL1. And these were, again, um, Polaroid style photo cards. I have seen these floating around for other members, but I haven't seen Wanu yet, because he is one of the more popular members, so three photo card fillers. All right, now moving on to the next comeback, which was Teenage. So for Teenage, I do have one photo card, which is very exciting. This is the Teenage Orange version photo card. Um, but let's go in order and let's put away the other version fillers first. Okay, so first off we have the white version. I actually really like the photo card for the white version. So really want that photo card to be honest. Then the green version and then we can finally store our first photo card. And last but not least, the Rose Quartz version. Okay, so that is it for Teenage. 
And finally, the first photo card is in. All right, now I'm moving on to director's cut. So for director's cut, I also have most of the inclusions. The only one that I don't have is this director, this black one, this photo card, but I don't know if I'll be able to get that anytime soon. So I have um, both of the normal photo cards and then these are the backs for them. I did show these photo cards in my Wanu haul as well. And then I have the really cute Lenti. Um, so he's kind of going peekaboo and that's really cute. So I guess I'll put away the two photo cards in these remaining two slots. And then we will go on to the next page for this photo card. I mean, well, this Lenti. And what I am going to do is this Lenti is going to go in the middle here because I want there to be more focus on it because it is so cute. And then I am going to put the director card in the first slot. And because after this comeback, we get on to You Make My Day, which is um, more substantial in terms of photo cards. I'm going to put a black filler here because I don't think I'll be putting any photo cards in here. And hopefully one day I'll be able to make some prettier fillers, but that should be okay for now. Okay, now moving on to You Make My Day. So for You Make My Day, there are six photo cards and I do have all six of them. So they are these two, these two, and these two. So basically they come in pairs and each pair has a ribbon back and a logo back. And what I'm gonna do for these photo cards is I'm gonna put all the ribbon ones here and all the logo ones here. So it will look, see I've already imagined how it's gonna look. So I'm gonna put them like this. And that should work out to look pretty nice, both on the front and also on the back. So yeah, I am really happy with how that looks. And there's exactly six. So that page looks very nice and pretty full. Okay, and then moving on to You Made My Dawn. So I don't have all of the photo cards for You Made My Dawn, but I do have three. And I believe these three are all of the logo version ones. So I think logo can go on top this time because I want the ribbon version to be in the middle row. So this is the Before Dawn logo version. Then the Dawn logo version. And the Eternal Sunshine, which happens to be one of my favorite photo cards. So yeah, um, and then for the second row, on this page, I am gonna put in some fillers that I made before. So again, before Dawn, the Dawn ribbon version and the Eternal Sunshine ribbon version. So that's what it looks like on the back as well. And yeah, that is You Made My Dawn all complete for now. Okay, and then I am not going to leave spaces. I'm just gonna continue with Wanu's photo cards as is. So now we are moving on to an ode. For an ode, I do have several photo cards. Um, there was a lot of photo cards for an ode anyway. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 photo cards out of 20, which is pretty good, I think. Um, so let's start off with begin. Um, so first off, we have the color back for begin. So I have this one, um, and that's the first one from the template. 
And then um, I'm going to put a filler in for the next one, which I don't have yet. Um, and then, yeah, I'm going to put another filler because the next one is not this one. And let's move on to the next page. And then for the next page, I'm going to start off with this one. Okay, next moving on to the poet version. So for the poet version, I have three out of four photo cards. Um, so I'm going to put this one in first, just here. Then I'm going to put one photo card filler for that missing color back poet photo card. And then I am going to put both of the white backs. Poet is definitely one of my favorite versions of an ode, so I'm very happy to do that. Now moving on to Hope version. So for Hope version, I only have the two white back photo cards. So I am going to put um, two Hope fillers in for the color back. And then both of these will go here. So next page. I like how these look. They look very nice. Um, so next page, we are going to move on to the real version. Uh, not real version. We're going to move on to the truth version. So for the truth version, I have three photo cards. And again, I'm missing one of the color back ones. So the first color back will go here. Then we're going to put a truth filler. And then we are going to put both of the white back ones. All right, and finally, last but not least, let's do the real version. So for the real version, I have two photo cards, one color back and one white back. So first off for the color back, then a filler, um, and then this white back will go in here. And another filler for here. And since this will just be an empty space, I am going to put a black filler for now. Okay, so yeah, that was an ode. Now let's move on to Hengare. So Hengare had four versions, and so eight photo cards in total. I'm going to put all of them onto one page and for now I only have three photo cards and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a black filler in the middle and then for the eight photo cards I'm going to have them like all around so basically um, Hana will go in these two then Du will go in these two Set will go in these two and Net will go in these two so no Hana for now, um, so let's put in the fillers. These are the two Hana fillers. Then I actually have both of the tool version and they are going to go in here. No set, so I'm going to put in fillers. And I have one net photo card, but not my favorite quarter 
photo card um, because as you guys might have heard from my Wanu haul video, um, that photo card was very highly sought after and it really cost quite a lot of money for that one. So just a filler for now. Um, next page, which will be the final album photo card page. So firstly, we have semicolon. And for semicolon, there were only two photo cards and it's these two. So nice and simple. And then I am going to put a black filler in here. I might get a pre-order benefit to put in here, or I might just wait to see if I collect three members or not. And then last but not least, uh, we have their latest comeback with your choice. And I don't have any photo cards now because I'm thinking of uh, trying out for a video call. And if I do that, then I will get a lot of inclusions. <laughs> so let's just put the fillers for now. Okay, so now that I've done all of the album inclusions, I am going to move on to um, non-album inclusions and also the Japanese photo cards. So I have a couple of HMV cards, then this Fallen Flower card, which I really like. I got this from my friend who just happened to be selling it for a really good price. Um, an incomplete card a season's greetings and three trading cards from Carrotland, I believe. So let's do the three HMV cards first. I am not gonna set up for these cards yet because I just don't have enough cards for it to be worthwhile. So I'm just gonna put them uh, in the same nine pocket page. But for now, it's pretty good that they actually fit here. And I think it looks okay. And I don't think we need the iPad anymore, so I'm just going to move it to the side. And that's it for photo cards. And now we are going to move on to larger inclusions. I am aiming to collect all of Wanu's album larger inclusions as well. So firstly, we have a bookmark from Love and Letter. And to go in this page as well, it's this really cute Polaroid from Adieu Nice. I think this item was also pretty rare. Kind of reminds me of the BTS Young Forever Polaroids. Um, now moving on to Hengare. So for Hengare, I have all four bookmarks. They were from my friend as well, and she sold them to me for something like $2 each, which is really good. And when I was thinking about how to set up for these bookmarks, I realized they fit into the four pocket page perfectly, and there's four of them as well, so that worked out really nicely. So that's these four. My favorite one is definitely this one. Okay, and another four pocket page, and this is for semicolon. So for semicolon, um, I got four larger inclusions. So this adorable sticker, the oval card, the uh, smaller postcard, and the mini pair. There was also a Wanu Sengguan postcard, but I decided not to get it um, because these four inclusions fit into the four pocket sleeve perfectly and I don't really want to mess up the four pocket sleeve by getting the last postcard. Okay, so that is it for semicolon. 
Next, moving on to some Kino cards. So these Kino cards are from my friend as well. So there's two for an ode and two for Hengare. So let's put an ode in first. And then Hengare. These postcards are really good quality and I think all of them, like OT13 would have come with the Kino album. And I love how the back looks as well. I think it's really satisfying. And last but not least, we have some concept Polaroids. So two of these are from an ode. And you can see it says ode to you on the back. And then two of these are from, I believe it's Carrotland 2020. Yep, Carrotland 2020. And these are so cute. I really like the styling and I, I kind of wish I could get OT13 for these Polaroids. But Wanu will satisfy me for now. Um, let's put these away. And yeah, that is actually all the items that I have to store. So I think as a last thing, I kind of want to flip through everything just to have a look. Um, so this is my future 17 binder, just one binder for now. This is the first page and we'll just flip quietly through. So yeah, that is it for the video today. I'm going to finish on my favorite page, which is currently the You Make My Day page because I have completed the photo cards. I'm really excited to collect 17 and to see where this collection takes me. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.